My wonderful friends and welcome back to another video today we're going to be talking all about period pants and no I don't mean pants from the Victorian era I mean pants that you can use on your period now on this channel I have done a couple of period videos before how to manage periods in a wheelchair and also trying the diva cup so please be sure to check those out if you haven't already now today's video is very kindly sponsored by Wuka. Wake up, kick ass. Thank you so much. Now, Wuka have developed period pants. <laughs> they are pants that feel and look just like your regular pants, but you can use them on your period, so there is no need to use pads or tampons. They come available for three types of flow, heavy, medium, and light. For a heavy flow, which is the pants that I am holding here, they hold up to four tampons worth. That's about 20 mils of liquid. That's more than any other product on the market. You can also wear them for up to eight hours. The material is carbon neutral and they have antibacterial properties. I really like these. These are kind of like, give me the sporty vibe, sort of like a Kelvin Klein kind of vibe to them. They've got the Wuka logo there. They also have this lensing model um, material here, which is kind of like um, an organza material around there. And then in the gusset um, is where you have got extra layers for the period flow. That comes up to about here and it was perfect. I sleep on my belly um, at night and I didn't have any leaks. And then it also comes up quite high on the bottom as well so you do feel very confident and secure knowing that there aren't going to be any leaks in terms of transferring absolutely fine they don't move around or get caught and most importantly i haven't had a wedgie yesterday the monthly gift arrived i had a shower put on a clean pair of the undies i chose to put on the sporty pair but they fit nicely around the legs which is what you need because obviously you don't want to have any leaks but when I woke up in the morning, I knew that I had to change them because that was the thing that I was a bit worried about is because they're black, you can't really see, but I could feel that it needed changing. So I had a quick shower and then I put on a new pair ready for the day. For a medium flow, these pants hold up to three tampons worth, which is about 15 mils. These ones are 100% my favorite ones. And to be honest, they are just like the undies that I wear anyway so you can hardly notice any difference apart from you've got that extra padding in the gusset for um any liquids so we've come up to the local park to take the dog for a walk as you can see the ground is quite uneven so i'm bouncing around all over the place i have got the medium cotton pants on at the moment and i'm feeling very dry and very confident in them at the moment another thing that i'm really liking about them is that they're not aggravating any of my cramps either For the lighter flows, they hold up to one tampon, which is about five to seven mils. They are easy to care for. You just rinse them and then wash them in your machine at 40 degrees with other like colors. And then you can line dry them, put them in the airing cupboard or near a heater, and they dry quite quickly next to a radiator. You can't tumble dry them, however, which is very important to remember. These are the two I have washed. They are laying and drying in the sun. They've been out for about an hour and they are still feeling quite damp. They've washed up really nicely. Just put them on the 40 degree wash and that's the situation we're at right now. Not only are these period pants, they can also be used for bladder leaks, discharge and also after birth which I think is fantastic because I know I bled for months after giving birth to Daisy and I have to use pants pads which was fiddly. I've got a small child you don't have any time to look after yourself so if I had these pants it would have made life a lot lot easier. Another style that I was sent were the high-waisted ones. They have the lensing model material that I featured on the uh, more sporty pair um, along the sides and then it's got the cotton panel at the front with the gusset with the um, layers to catch period liquids and then at the back it comes up quite high again preventing leaks or anything like that. 
Today I went up to Tesco and I wore the high-waisted pants and again I felt very secure, very dry, very comfortable and transferring in and out of the car was not a problem at all. Um, I also loved the convenience of the pants as well. They are so easy, they're just as easy as a regular pair of pants to get on and off. Um, I don't have dexterity problems but I struggle with pads and tampons sometimes and they are quite fiddly. But with the pants you just pull them on, pull them up and off you go. For anyone who does struggle with their hands or arms and finds you know intricate things quite fiddly, something like these period pants would be a fantastic thing to look into. Now the high-waisted ones aren't personally for me, I don't really like things around my waist too much, especially my undies, but could these be good for people with colostomy bags, catheters, scarring, I think, you know, after birth scars for 100% these would be fantastic. Um, they're also really, really supportive, so if you're suffering with cramps or anything like that, they do feel quite comfortable in that respect. Another thing that I'm absolutely loving is the fact that my bathroom bin is practically empty at the moment. <laughs> okay, there might be a toilet roll, but that's it. Usually by this stage in the game, it's full and I have to empty it. So it's really nice to know that I'm doing something a little bit helpful for the environment as well. Now, when I asked you what you thought about period pants, if you tried them, lots of you said that they were life-changing, they were so, so good, and you have been really, really pleased with them. But on the other hand, a lot of you were saying that you are a bit hesitant to try them because of how expensive they are. And you're right, they are expensive, but in the long run, they are gonna save you a lot of money, which is why today it's very exciting to tell you that Wooka have launched a brand new basics range. They're almost half the price of the other underpants that I have shown you, but they still have that amazing quality feel. Now, I absolutely love these. These are the Medium Flow Basics, which have um, just launched. As you can see, they come down a little bit lower, but they are very, very similar to the Medium Cotton pair that I showed you. It has slightly different stitching, and some of the seams are visible, whereas they're not visible on the other pair that I showed you but these are fantastic they feel just as snug just as um, supportive and um, they're perfect for when you're transferring and no wedgies they are only available for medium and light but honestly they are still just as fantastic and if you're looking to give them a try and you're a bit hesitant to you know go in head first and get the most expensive ones you could try these and see how they feel see if you like the feel of them and how they work for you first of all. These have launched just today so make sure you check out the link in the description box and the pinned comment so you can have a look at their new range. Not only do they have the stars that I have shown you, they also do pants for cycling, they've even got bikini pants for people on a lighter flow so you can go swimming and they have a teen range as well because I know I really struggled having to remember pads, fiddling around with them in the toilets and you know it's it's all very very awkward when you're a teen now if you do decide to go over to their website and have a look they have a wealth of information about periods not only that they have started a petition to the government to recognize period pants as a period product because at the moment we are being charged 20% VAT on period pants because the government aren't recognizing them as a period product. Period products aren't a luxury, they are a necessity. So if you do have some time and you do feel passionate about it, please sign and share their petition. So I am going to share with you my top tips for trying period pants if you're interested in giving them a go. On their website they do offer a pack of three, which I would highly recommend that you invest in trying first. That gives you enough to try for about a day or so to see if you like them. I would definitely recommend that you try them maybe on your lighter days first. It's all about trying to get used to them. I don't think you can make a decision if they are for you on your first period. I think you've got to give them two or three periods worth a go. Now, one question that I think might come up is what if you are going out for a long day? Um, obviously, at the moment, we're all in um, lockdown, so we're not going out for days and the world has changed dramatically and I'm not going out for long days like up to London and things like that. 
If I was on a heavy day, I would probably be more inclined to go for a tampon, but I'm still gonna be cutting down my um, waste for the environment because I will be using those pants on the lighter days. If you did want to stick to the period pants and you've got a heavy period and you're going out for the day, changing the pants is gonna be a bit tricky, especially if you're in a wheelchair and you have limited mobility. I would suggest there maybe taking a tampon or a pad to slide in there. There's definitely enough room if you needed that. With regards to comfort and how they fit, I think they are fantastic. They are a little bit tight around the legs and that's definitely something to bear in mind if, you're used, if your skin is prone to being very sensitive and easily rubs and could be broken down due to your spinal cord injury. I really enjoyed wearing these period pants and this is definitely something that I am going to continue to use. I personally won't be using them on my heavier days simply because I find that I personally don't like the feel of it. If you are fine with using pads then these are 100% for you. I am going to be using them on the lighter days for sure. I also find that my period kind of teases me a bit in a couple of days leading up to it. So I'll just have like a bit of spotting and a bit of discharge here and there. So these will be great for those days as well when I'm waiting for the actual flow to start. Also when I finish my period, a couple of, I'll go for a couple of days without anything and then a couple of days later I'll have a bit of spotting and discharge again. So again, that is when I'm going to be using Using the period pants. One thing that did strike me about these period pants is how comfortable they are. If you shut my eyes and put knickers on me and didn't tell me if they were my regular knickers or the period knickers, I wouldn't be able to tell the difference. I do have sensation down there by the way, so I do know um, how it is feeling. So that is it for today's video. If you've got any questions, please leave them down below. Also, if you have any tips for wearing period pants in a wheelchair, then please drop those down below as well because I know I got a few over on my Instagram. And speaking of Instagram, don't forget to join me there tomorrow when I'll be answering all of your questions there as well. Make sure to check out the link and have a look at these um, underpants. Let me know if you've tried them. And I look forward to seeing you in my next video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.